Just about nearly 400 miles north of the town of Albany, Oregon, lies one of North America's largest and most beautifully defined cities, Vancouver, Canada. And although a streamlined trip by car took me seven hours to reach my destination, I was destined to spend even more time in the realm of discovery, exploring, photographing, and soaking in this vivid splendor of British Columbia. Did you know Vancouver, B.C. was founded in 1886 and was named after Captain George Vancouver, an English officer in the British Royal Navy. George Vancouver was well known for his exploration and precise charting of North America's Pacific coast. Today, many North American landmarks have names that were given by Vancouver, including Mount Rainier, Mount Hood, Mount St. Helens, and many others. Due to the convenience of its seaports and the arrival of the Transcontinental Railroad, Vancouver quickly grew from its early settlement of a few thousand to its current population of well over 600,000. With over 2.4 million people living in the greater Vancouver area, it's become the fourth most densely populated city in North America. In terms of livability, Vancouver often rates within the world's top 10 cities. It may seem strange, but with all the curiosities that one may encounter while traveling abroad, there was only one that kept my eyes fixed on the ground. Weeds. Even in wintertime, on the streets of such a massive metropolis, I could easily spot this nature's produce. Down an alley, and nestled against a building, I immediately see a group of wild edibles, most of which can be eaten raw. Along the cracks, I found members of the mustard, lettuce, and plantain family. Many varieties of lactuca, wild lettuce, have a history of medicinal properties worth investigating. Hard to miss is the broadleaf dock. Its fresh, tender leaves and stems can be eaten raw as a tart green, or cooked as a vegetable. Chickweed is a juicy and tender green similar to lettuce, perfect as a base for salads or in addition to your favorite sandwich. Chickweed can be distinguished by the single line of hairs running down its stem. Self-sowed between two sidewalks is a row of bittercress. This member of the mustard family is rich with flavor and can be added to foods as a tasty spice. Whether you're a wild edible food enthusiast like myself or simply an adventurous person seeking a new playground, Vancouver, BC is well equipped to appease your appetite. So next time you find your eyes hooked on the sights of a new city, be sure to also take a look down by your feet. There just may be an exotic dish perched in that not-so-exotic location. Thanks for watching, and please subscribe. Till next time, happy foraging! <laughs>